important that you follow the steps of segmental retaining wall construction. Starting at the lowest grade point, getting a proper layout, knowing your property lines. Making sure that you excavate following the 6666 rule. Six inches beyond the heel and toe of the block. Six inches deep and six inches for embedment. Making sure that you properly classify your subgrade. In this case, we have a silt soil, so we're going to use vibratory compactive efforts. From there, making sure that you install a geotextile fabric. In this case, a woven type. That woven type is tensioned at 3%. Why? So the tension in two directions can bridge minor differential settlement of the subgrade. It extends up the sides of the walls of the excavation and then overlaps. Now our base is installed. That base is a three quarter inch clean stone, clear stone. The reason we chose it, it's self consolidating and it's freeze thaw insusceptible. If any water gets in here in the winter, it simply expands into that void space without affecting the integrity of our wall. Our bedding layer is a number eight stone. It's used to choke off the 57s and give us a good level bed to get our block in level front to back and side to side. Our block's going to be the Raffinato polished. You can see the corner unit here, which is polished on two sides. Otherwise, the units are polished on the long side. It's available in a seven and a three and a half. This is going to complement everything on our pool deck.